all of award season has led to this moment here tonight. You have had an amazing award season with the cast of CODA. What is one memory from this experience that you'll never forget? I think watching them and being reminded the very first time I saw them, reminding myself of going through the first time at the, at the Oscars 35 years ago. It's such a joy to watch them. It was a joy to watch them embrace that first moment. They are in awe, just as I was in awe, but I'm also in awe of them now. How does it feel to be back here again tonight as a nominee of a Best Picture nominated film? It feels, I'm very honored, as anyone would feel, to be here, but it's extra special because it's my culture that's, being, that's on, on stage. The message is being passed to everyone, whoever sees the film, and uh, it's just a lot of fun. What do you hope the success of CODA means for the future of deaf representation in Hollywood? I hope that, and I feel that it's already begun, that people in Hollywood will be giving jobs to deaf actors, directors, writers, and people behind the scenes. It's just, uh, it's, it's really great. The doors are gonna spread wide open. Of course, Troy Kotzer is nominated for Best Supporting Actor tonight. What would it mean to you to see him win? It would mean the world to me to have finally another deaf actor who's gotten an Oscar. It's been 35 years, that's a pretty long time. Nobody else who's deaf has ever gotten an Oscar, so fingers are crossed. My fingers are crossed too. I loved your film and I hope you have an amazing night tonight. Thank you so much. You're welcome, thank you, good to see you.